Police in Canandaigua have a section of Main Street closed off for an investigation and they have just provided an update within the last few minutes. We're going to head right out to Christian Garzone who is in Canandaigua with the details he just learned moments ago. Christian. Well, Adam, Teresa, police say about 1.30 this afternoon there were reports of a suspicious man by the Sunoco or 7-Eleven. Police said both of those gas stations. Either way, it's a gas station behind me here. Uh, police say that man pulled out a gun. Somewhere in this, he fired. He was then tased, and police returned fire at him. The man was airlifted to Strong, but police will not say anything about his condition at this time. In fact, they took no questions at the press conference, which was really a first for me. Now, here's a scene behind me. On scene, we have the Ontario County Sheriff's Office, Canandaigua Police, State Police, and we did have some emergency crews, but they have since uh, left. Main Street is blocked off from Phelps Street down to Routes 5 and 20. There is tape blocking the sidewalks from the Rochester, Region, Rochester Regional Health Building here across the street to a tire center. There are evidence markers behind me here. Uh, police are picking up pieces of the crime scene. Now, this is the same spot, roughly, where an officer-involved shooting took place earlier this year when a Pennsylvania man was shot dead. This investigation, of course, is ongoing. We're still waiting on details. When we learn more, we'll bring them to you right here on News 8. Live in Canandaigua, Christian Garzone, News 8. Adam Teresa. Right back to you in the studio. Christian, thank you. As you mentioned, this story is still developing, and we will keep you up to date with the latest both on air and at rochesterfirst.com.